Hello, I am going to show you how to post on your community wall in Active Building. Um, so for this example, I am in the novella and I am going to uh, be posting about a uh, social event that they have coming up, which is a virtual networking happy hour. Um, so I have the file and I have saved it as a JPEG so it actually shows up in the post and I want it to be a featured post and there's a few things about the event that I want to relay to the resident. Alright, gets the point across and I'm going to see how it posts. Perfect. So when you post a JPEG, it does actually show as a picture, and so people will be able to see it. Um, similar to like scrolling on something in social media, you can actually click on it and enlarge it. When you post just a PDF or a Word document as an attachment, it's going to look like this. Um, so the next thing I'm going to do is actually create an event for that. Um, so we had a virtual mixology class last week, um, so I'm going to create uh, another event, um, networking happy hour on Kobu. And I have that saved to my desktop. And it starts July, it's July 9th at 6.30. And I think it's only a half an hour. Oh, is it here? I don't know. Oh my gosh, seven, okay. We're going to allow them to sign up. Uh, I think it makes you um, put in an actual location if you do offsite. So I'm just going to say it's virtual, there is no cost, and there we go. And so, if you go back to basically your, you know, your home screen, you're going to see your post and then the event. Is there? You can also sign up on behalf of a resident for a resident, uh, just FYI. But this is really an app sponsored by this resident services app that they've subscribed to, which is Kobu. So we're really trying to promote it on Kobu through Kobu. But this is just a way for us to generate some um, interest and engagement. And if someone should sign up through Active Building, we can always go on Kobu and actually update that. So it wouldn't be the end of the world. Um, but that is, generally speaking, how to use your wall um, and how to post things so everyone will see them. Now, if you are looking to actually send out a message to everyone, so say an actual email about something's closed down temporarily, something's under construction, you would uh, you have the ability to, well, I have the ability to send it to a lot of different things, but you can go to your community um, specify if it's general or a facilities or operations update. Who? You can type in the entire community, put in the subject, attach a file, which is a big thing we can't do through uh, the bulk email feature within OneSite. Write your message and then you have delivery options. Um, I don't know too many people who use the voice, um, but if you have residents set up for SMS notifications, I would probably check these two. Um, but just keep in mind you have a limit here if you do SMS. And you're going to hit send. 
That's it.